So we need. How do I? How do I? How do I do? What do I? The entire city is asleep. Chalk. I don't think he would. Uh, the entire city. Joey, give the totem to Rosa. That won't do any good. According to Maddie, this only works on aware spooks. Are you trying to use my own essence on me? Uh, yeah? Such an action speaks of desperation. It will not be long before you will not need to worry about such things. Oh, wait a minute. No, 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 no. First we have to activate the circle. First we activate the circle. That won't do any good. According to Maddie, this will No, activate the circle. What are you doing? Looks like the... I just can't... That won't do any... That won't do... I can't do anything. It looks like the circ... So... Chalk? This isn't the time to draw... Um... I don't get it. Shall we... Nope, still a... Below the chalk I'm not circle. Just get... I don't understand. Don't I draw a circle and then trap Madeline inside it? So, Rosa... He wasn't caring. I'm not white. I don't understand. Cuts. That won't help. A sharp scalpel. Joey got it from. Pipe. That won't. So when I go up, we both go up. Can I talk to her? Madeline. What? Please, Madeline, you tried. You failed. Just stop before any more damage is done. Failed? No. I admit my original plan did not proceed as I'd hoped. This is just a viable alternative. This is not the only alternative. We will help you find another way. Can you really? The universe is pouring into your head. Your head is splitting from the pressure of it. So tell me, with all of this newfound knowledge, can you give me even one alternative to achieve what I need? You've spent hundreds of years helping out souls like them. You're really gonna throw all that away? You say that like they matter. Since humanity crawled out of the ocean, they began to deny death. Denied it so much that the post of bestower was created. In all that time, humanity has learned nothing. Helping their pathetic souls all this time has achieved nothing. So you'll destroy them all. It is a means to an end. Nothing more. Uh, you destroyed my family. You destroyed my family. It was nothing personal. You don't understand, do you? We could have supported each other. We could have been normal. You took that from us. From me. And yet, here you are. Don't tell me you are worse off. You survived. Thrived even. Not for much longer if you keep this up. As I said, this is nothing personal. We're going to stop you, Madeline. And what makes you think that? We've stopped others before you, we can do it again. Others before me? Like who? Hmm. We stopped the Deacon. That mad, incorrigible soul. A man so insane with fear that he created the devil out of thin air. There are so many spirits like him. Spirits so scared and so desperate that they will do anything to escape. Your deacon would have welcomed the oblivion that I am bringing. But you are so desperate to do anything. The Countess. My aunt killed her. I finished her off. You forget. She was my host once. Whatever happened to her, it was her own undoing. I am through with being at the service of hosts like her. Of anyone like her. And this is how you're doing it? There is no other way. I stopped Gavin. He got into my head and I forced him out. Gavin? Yes. I sensed it when you killed him. That was an accident. Be that as it may, his soul was weak after he tried to feed on you. It didn't take long to overpower him. So, thank you for delivering him to me. Possess me again. What? I mean it. If it means all this stops, do it. I have expended too much energy. Your mind would overpower me and reject me, like all the others. But the author is appreciated. 
So I'm sure that we. Wait, what? I didn't say that. Uh. I was sure that we would just. This isn't the time to. The entire city is. A... I don't. I don't really understand. Look, whatever she's doing, it's happening on the other side. Oh. Maybe we should take a look? Oh, okay. We have to we have to come over here before we do anything? Something doesn't feel right. What is Madeline doing? No. One day I'll go through there, but not today. Platform. Alright, so we draw it here for some reason. Alright, and then Joey. Activate this. I can't touch the thing. No, activate it. I'm not just. It's the exit ramp out of this existence. Whatever. How do you? How do you activate? Oh, you use the tie. Use a bit of my essence, huh? Well, here goes. Right. And now we use the totem on Madeline. All right, here you go. Got him. What is this? Get wrecked. Oh, how cute. This place. Well, no matter. Hey, <laughs> you, you remember me. I guess I should be flattered. Open the portal, let me through. You've got to be kidding. The energy is almost at critical mass. It is going to detonate whether I am there or not. Oh. Oh, that's all you can say. Millions of souls will be destroyed. I need to be one of them. We all need something. I thought I needed to move on, but I really want to see how this ends. It will never end. I will never end. That was the whole purpose. It was never about you. Not me, or my niece, or any of us. You see, I get it now. Why things have to be the way they are. I don't like it, but I get it. What are you talking about? Shh! <laughs> I'm on a smoke break. <laughs> it didn't stop. No. It's not going to stop. No. This is it, isn't it? No. No, it isn't. So many dead, Joey, so many. I know. It's never enough. I know, but we do the best we can. We always have. Yes. We always have. What the? Are those? Are those spooks? Yes. Everyone who is lost. Everyone who is waiting. Waiting for someone like us. No more. They don't have to wait anymore. You're saving spooks? It's what we do. But how? That vortex. It was creating a mass of spiritual energy. I'm reversing it. Making it pull in spiritual energy instead of pushing it out. You can do that? I can now. You see? It's not about you or me. It's about everyone. Go on, Joey. Go on? It's time. Move on. You can do it now. Whatever stopped you from moving on before? I'm stronger. Yes. We get rid of him. Yes, go. It's not working. What? I said it's not working. It won't let me go. No, go. Try it now. Go, you I'm dishbag. Sorry, sweetheart, but, but I'm still stuck. No, go. Not even the power of the universe inside your head can help me move on. Go, you douchebag. Don't come back. Oh, my God. He, ch he deliberately didn't go. It's gone. Son of a bitch. I'm sorry, Joey. Forget it. So, you think everyone down there is back to normal? Yes. Everyone will wake up. They won't even know they were asleep. It will be like it never happened. Yeah. We should get out of here. Son of a bitch. He didn't go. He deliberately so, didn't go. how many spooks did you manage to save, anyway? All of them. All of them? 
Yes. So, um, are we talking all the spooks here in the city, or...? No. All ghosts. Everywhere. Except for me. Except for you. That's... I know. Look, don't sweat it. I mean, people are still gonna die, right? There'll be more ghosts. Eventually. Right, so when that happens, it'll be business as usual. I guess. But in the meantime, we're free. Free? Yeah. How about a movie or something? God, I haven't seen a movie in forever. You and me both. Think of all the things we can do now. Maybe I'll sleep in. Or maybe a vacation? No. Yeah, somewhere sunny. Huh? I'm sorry, Joey. I thought you'd be gone. I really hoped you'd be gone. I didn't want you to see this. Red? It hurts, Joey. It's everything. It's pouring into my head. It's not a metaphor, and it's not stopping. I can't hold it. You gotta try. No. It's like trying to swallow the ocean. Sooner or later, you're going to drown. No, not after what you just did. Not after everything we've done. You can't just... What? Die? I don't think... I have a choice. No. This isn't fair. This isn't right. You just saved the whole damn city. You saved me. I knew the cost. I paid it. It was worth it, wasn't it? Sure. Of course it was. I... I see them. My parents, Joey. I see them. No, stay away from them. It's not time yet. Joey, please. Thrashing. Thrashing. Okay. But before you go, I'll make you one promise. No matter how long I'm around, no matter how many hosts I see die, I'm not going to turn into Madeline. Ever. Not if I'm a spook for a million years. I'll be a good spirit guide. Do what needs to be done. Forever if need be. No, Joey. You won't. <laughs> what? Ugh. What? What the... What? What did you... How? Red? That is, Sweetheart? doesn't make any sense. Rosa? This what? That's the most stupid the thing I've ever seen. did you do this? Here. Go on, take it. Take it. Just. That's the most stupid thing I've ever seen. What was that supposed to be? I don't see him anymore. I've tried, you know. I've looked. There was this pile-up on the West Side Highway last week, and now people say they hear crying. So I went over there. I didn't hear or see anything. I'm normal. Listen to me, talking to myself on the street. I call myself normal. Yeah, I know. Ironic, huh? Or at least I think that's irony. You could tell me, if you were here. I'm forgetting things. What? About being, you know, I can't even say it. It's almost as if, now that I'm alive, I can't think about being dead. I guess that's hardwired into everybody. Turns out I'm just like everyone else in the end. Throw yourself I off that bridge. It now. I like being alive. Is that so wrong? Is that what I'm supposed to get from all this? That life is worth living? I guess I gotta get out there and find out for myself. No, throw yourself off that bridge, why don't you? Goodbye, Rosa Blackwell. I don't know how long I've got, but I know I'll see you again. Someday. But until then, I'll try to make this count. Okay? What? Oh, okay. But why do they need to do that? I don't understand. Why don't they just have Joey go and that's it? Have Joey go to the other place? Why do they have to do this? Why did anyone think this was a good idea?
did I did I miss something? Did I was there multiple endings or was that it? That was so bad that ending. Why does Joey magically become a living person again? Why why didn't he just go with the like if I wrote the story, he would just go with the other spirits, he'll be happy. And then and then with that, why why would this happen? What just happened? Why? That doesn't make any sense. That literally doesn't make any sense. Why would a ghost become a living person again? What? Uh, anyway, I don't know. You know what? A lot of people don't know how to end stories. A lot of video games, and we just gonna we just have another one, the Blackwell series. Another story that just didn't know how to end. Holy cow! That was the stupidest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Everything was so good up until that point too. <laughs> am, am, right? Am I, I? Am I? Am I the wrong? Am I wrong? Right? I mean, that, that was stupid, right? Anyway, so okay, the fifth game was excellent. The fourth game was really good. The fifth game was excellent. The ending is absolute crap. But just try to wipe the last minute of that from your mind and pretend that never happened. The same way we do with uh, Mass Effect Three and you know other things. So just just wipe that from your brain and pretend it never happened. And it's a it's a great game. It's a great game. I I've forgotten it already. In my mind, Joey just went off into the void and uh, everything's great. So yeah, that was uh, that was cool. That was a great great game, great story. And you know, like the first two games were definitely not up to standard. The third game was borderline. But once we got to the fourth game and the fifth game in the series, it was a very, very high quality adventure game. I mean, the story was interesting all the way through, but it ramped up pretty well. The game mechanics were dodgy in the first two games, and then they kind of smoothed out in the, in the last three games. It was, yeah, it was really good. By the time they got to the fifth game, it was really, really good. So there you go. Uh, there are some issues. There are some issues with nagging. There are some issues with Joey being a, a douchebag. And like not only being a douchebag, but him not realizing he's a douchebag, and I think the the story writer not realizing he's a douchebag, which is a problem. And the fact that they made Joey live in the end, I don't know. I don't know if the if the person who wrote the story thought that we're supposed to identify with Joey, and somehow we're supposed to root for Joey, but I don't. I hated Joey. I rooted for Rosa. You know what I mean? So, uh, that's just, yeah. I I disagree. I disagree with how things ended. And I think they could have made like a few multiple endings. I think I could have. I think they could have just made it so that, like, when the portal was closing, they could have just given the player the, the choice to go into the portal or not go into the portal, and just have give them that choice, and that would have been. If if they did that, I think I would be a, be just perfectly happy. I'd be perfectly happy if they gave like just two separate endings and you could choose. All right, that's the end. I guess I'll stop ranting. It turned out to be a great game, or at least like the second half, the second two thirds of the series. It turned out to be a really great game. So there you go. There's the Blackwell series of adventure games. Is it gonna? Do I have to click? Oh, it doesn't. It doesn't quit. It doesn't just exit the game. It goes back to the menu, so we don't get cut out. All right. I don't. I don't think I need to really say much else. I think I've said pretty much I want to say for the entire series. It turned out. I mean, the end. It was really good. It started off, yeah. It started off kind of. It stumbled a little bit at the start. Ended up really good. I hate Joey. Joey's a bad person. All right, I'll see you all in future playthroughs.